So let me teach you how to stop the two-step verification from Amazon. All you have to do is first of all go to your account. It's very important. Let's say you're not signed in and you try to sign in. Definitely you should uh, sign up immediately or sign in depending because I believe you already have an account. So over here I'll be prompted for a two-step verification. All I have to do is um, put it there and um, I will log in immediately. And uh, so in case you don't know how to set up two-step verification or you find any problem, uh, check the, my videos. There are related content you can watch and solve this very easily so you can get a OTP so easily. So now what I'll do now is first of all, you're having this, whether you're doing on your PC, just locate your account over this place. So now you're in your account, uh, move on to the account here. Then it's going to open on a full screen where we have your order, we have login, we have prime, we have your payment. Basically, you can do a lot of things here regards your account. Very, very easy to do. So now we'll move on to this uh, place called login and security. So I'm going to hit on login and security. Then we prompted to edit a lot of stuff about us. By side to edit our name, side to anything you want to edit here, you can move down to your password and make changes to your password. But trust me, when you make changes to this, it is going to appear immediately on your mail. That is why it's good you have a valid mail that you receive notifications anytime someone try to hack in or sign in into your mail. So we have the primary phone numbers. If you try to use this currently, Amazon is not sending OTP to phone number. So that is why we're using the Google Authenticator. But when it becomes a problem, you can, that is why you might want to disable it. But above all, it's better. So you can uh, add another other step by trying to, if someone try to do some stuff, you can sign out immediately from all accounts or all devices you've logged into before. So now we're going to move on the two-step verification by managing it immediately. So click on manage the hub. And when you click on manage, then you have this power to disable immediately. So, but right now it's enabled. So when I click on disable, which I'm not clicking, I'll just click on disable. It's going to be disabled immediately. So when I click on disable, see what it's going to ask you by disabling two-step verification, OTP will no longer be required to sign in into your account. So what I'll do now is I could disable it and try login again, but better still, you can do that yourself and see if it needs OTP to sign in again. All right. In case Amazon tell you to update your account, you get anything like update, simple, just uh, go straight. Uh, one trick I think Amazon has been sending people to tell you to update your account. All you have to do is to just add OTP. So I advise you watch the video, the link, check the description. There is a link on how to add uh, OTP, which is using Google, uh, receive OTP, sorry, using Google Authenticator. So I advise you just to watch that and set up your OTP once and for all and disable it anytime you like. So you can send this to your friends so that they can watch as well. And please don't forget to like at the same time, subscribe for more of these. Thank you guys for watching.